factors affecting population of a place. It is an established fact that population of any area or country of the world is not constant and changes with time. There are several reasons for this change. The most important of these is the natural increase or natural decline of population of a given area. As conditions become favourable for humans to settle, more and more children were born and this led to growth of population. However, due to diseases and other natural calamities, the number of people dying was also high. When the number of births per thousand people, called birth rate, is more than the number of deaths per thousand people, called death rate, there was an increase in population, called growth rate. Besides natural increase, population change is also affected by migration or movement of people from one place to another. When people from other area or country come into an area, it is called immigration or immigration. On the contrary, when people leave an area or country to settle in some other place, it is called out-migration or emigration. Presently, migration is very limited due to strict migration laws in many nations of the world, but in historical times, a number of people migrated thousands of kilometres to settle in new lands, causing population changes in different areas of the world. World Trends of Population Change The growth of population is very dramatic, in the sense that in the late 19th century, there were about a billion people living on the earth. But by the end of 20th century, it had reached the 6 billion mark. We can safely assume that natural resources have to be stretched far beyond their capacity to take care of the needs of such a large number of people. During the early periods of human history, the growth of population was very slow and people were leading a nomadic life. Scarcity of food and spread of diseases were the main causes of slow growth. It all changed when people started leading a settled life. As they inhabited river valleys, agriculture developed and there was a steady growth of population. Low growth rate The reason for this change was the change in birth rate, number of births per thousand people, and the death rate, number of deaths per thousand people. The growth rate is the difference between the birth rate and the death rate. The developed countries of the world have low birth rate and low death rate due to advanced medical facilities. Thus, growth rate is generally less than 15 persons per thousand. Such countries are developed countries like USA, Canada, Russia, Sweden, Switzerland, Australia and other European countries. High growth rate The developing nations in Asia, Africa and South America have high birth rate and low death rate. Their annual growth is almost double than the developed countries. Their growth rate is about 30 persons per thousand. Egypt, Ethiopia, Kenya, Algeria, Brazil, Mexico, etc. belong to this category. In these countries, due to large-scale illiteracy and poverty, most programs of population control have become meaningless. Population change in India India has also not fared well in population control due to obvious reasons. The recent census or counting of population and collection of relevant data has revealed that in the past five decades, the growth of population has been phenomenal. In the 1920s, natural calamities such as floods and famine took their toll. Even since the social and medical facilities have improved, as a result, life expectancy or the number of years a person is likely to live has gone up from 23 years in 1901 to 63 years in 1999. 
the drop in birth rate is still not very impressive as most of the indian population in the rural areas especially the women are poor and illiterate they along with their male counterpart do not accept the notion of raising small families migration of population migration is the movement of people in and out of an area it is another way by which population size changes after the discovery of americas in the 16th century there was a wave of emigration from european countries to settle in america thus countries like the united states of america and australia have gained in numbers by immigration or immigration sudan is an example of a country that has experienced a loss in population numbers due to out migration or emigration the general trend of international migrations is from the less developed nations to the more developed nations in search of better employment opportunities within countries large number of people may move from the rural to urban areas in search of employment education and health facilities migration is also influenced by natural calamities shortage of water wars and strife etc that forces people to safer places sometimes from one part of the country to another often from one country to another during independence in india the new country pakistan was created that led to riots and migration across the borders composition of population the size of population has little to do with its level of economic development for example both bangladesh and japan are very densely populated but japan is far more economically developed than bangladesh this is an important factor in understanding the resource value of population people vary greatly in their age sex literacy level health condition population and income level it is necessary to understand these characteristics of the people population composition refers to the structure of the population the composition of population helps us to know how many are males or females sex ratio which age group age composition they belong to how educated literacy rate and level they are and what type of occupations occupational structure they are employed in and what are their income levels and health condition